I'm Jane Anderson Brown. Um, I'm the director of Red Earth Opera and we're here today because we're all desperate to perform and we've got the opportunity to perform out of doors and the work I've chosen for today is Vivaldi's Gloria which is an optimistic piece, part of the Create to Recover uh, initiative so uh, it seems very very appropriate. Tell us about your team and where they're coming from today. Right. Um, the furthest away is our bass player who has supported us in the past and he's coming all the way from Princess Risborough to take part. Hello, I'm Graham Hollingdale, obviously playing double bass today with the Create to Recover with the Red Earth Opera. The uh, arts were asked to close down just ahead of the full lockdown and uh, despite a few events being planned this in fact will be my first to actually take place so it's absolutely huge to get uh, the performing arts out and uh, having an audience come to enjoy We've got people coming up from Cornwall, we've got people coming over from Dorset and we've got people coming down from North Devon, as well as people from Torbay, Dawlish, Chudley and more and fairly local. I'm Lindsay Hughes. I have played with Red Earth Opera a couple of times. Uh, obviously over lockdown really missed working with other musicians I have since now been able to play some chamber music but to actually come and do a live performance working with a larger group and with uh, an audience to listen is just amazing Red Earth Opera. Um, basically what we're doing today, we're just doing songs from Vivaldi's Gloria, doing a bit of Heinemann as well. I think one of the good things about singing with this group is everybody's got experience in what they're doing, so you learn different things, especially because I've never done this sort of thing before. Yeah, every, uh, like I'm learning different things every time we sing from different people, I'm learning a new genre of music as well, so it's very cool to do. Um, my name's Marissa Wakefield, I'm the Centre Director here at Cookings and Court. Um, events are so um, important to us here on so many levels, they bring the place alive. And, and also we have all the studio holders, so it helps um, those to meet people and the business and the trade improve as well. But to see the park you know, full of people enjoying themselves is really what we're about here. The event today is incredible because it's an actual performance of people that have been isolated and not able to, you know, come out to meet each other and sing together. So, you know, on that level alone, those guys are coming together and performing together, but also that other people can hear it too, whether they're walking the dog or working or, you know, painting here as well. And, you know, it's absolutely phenomenal that those guys are going to be allowed, you know, to get together and, and who knows what they're going to create. That's what's so exciting. When lockdown happens, suddenly everything that I got up for stopped. And that is true for uh, quite a number of people here today, either as performers or music teachers. The schools closed, they were out of work, um, the theatres closed, so those playing in theatre pit bands and so on were all out of work. Everything just stopped. And several of the people in the group have already said that they had difficulty getting out of bed for the first couple of months of lockdown. This is something to get, not only to get out of bed for, but to travel down to Torquay and to get involved in. Hi, I'm Martin Thomas. I'm Executive Director of Torbay Culture. We're here today in Cockington because it's one of the events as part of Create to Recover, which is uh, Arts Council England supported recovery programme here in Torbay. Um, they really wonderfully supported us. Um, it's meant that we've been able to support nine projects across Torbay, Brixham, Paynton and Torquay, um, in all sorts of art forms, all sorts of creative practice, from music to writing and performance, and filmmaking, 
uh, all sorts of things, visual arts as well, and all those artists who are locally based are celebrating Torbay's local heritage in special places, just like this in Cockington. This afternoon, the performance is Gloria by Vivaldi, with other music as well, performed by Red Earth Opera, who you can just hear a getting going in the background, um, led by Jane Anderson Brown. And she's done a wonderful job of bringing together performers from London, Cornwall, Devon, uh, to this amazing historic place, Cockington, to perform outside for people to enjoy. The sound will resonate from the Sea Change Studios through the Rose Garden and the historic gardens of Cockington. And um, it's good to see people are coming out uh, to listen to the music.